Greetings, Atomy family. I'm McNulty Korea's CEO, Unjung Lee. McNulty has been making coffee since 1997 for about 21 years now. We've been focusing on only coffee since then. McNulty Korea is a coffee company. In 1993, I brought over McNulty from the U.S. to Korea. We started as a cafe business. And we started roasting our own beans since 1997. In 2015, we were the first coffee company to go public in Kostak. As I know, we were also the first to be accredited as a venture business. The accompanied growth committee did a survey on small and medium-sized companies. And results showed that we were number one in the market. I've received various awards from the president and even from the Ministry of Industry. I am not saying I did anything special, but rather it was because our company walked the same path and was able to scale our business. Uh, I don't think there are many Korean products that can beat the taste and worldwide popularity of coffee mix. Korea's coffee mix products are already loved by worldwide consumers. I actually love coffee mix myself. I never sell products that I don't love. I believe I was very lucky. We are indeed a company that roasts coffee beans well. But we did a good job with our coffee mix product as well. But we were devastated when it did not sell very well. When Adami proposed that we try this product again, I wanted to take up the challenge once more. And I thought that if we could achieve absolute price and absolute quality, we could make this product marketable. The quality of the coffee beans had to be essential for our Cafe Arabica beans, which we are using, they have to pass Brazil's BSCA certification, uh, which is known for having very strict standards. The coffee beans we use are 100% Arabica Brazilian beans. Companies usually don't use Arabica beans on coffee mix products. That is because Arabica beans are a lot more expensive. In McNulty, we purchase the beans that we need from Brazil in bulk at least a year before we roast them. We acquire a year's worth of beans in advance to lower our expenses. Adami proposed to McNulty we launch a coffee mix product with Arabica beans in order to come up with a product that is good. That is why I thought we needed to make a good product. After this, we invested a lot to improve our quality control. At the time, we were trying to make this product. There was a hot issue about the negative effects of sodium casinate. In order to develop a creamer without sodium casinate, it took us about two years to finally develop it. It was a very meticulous process. If it was our own product, we would not have been able to take so long. But Atomy wanted an excellent quality product, and in order to meet their standards, it took us a long time. You can now drink our coffee mix product with no health concerns. I'm a big fan as well. This was the first product launched between Atomy and McNulty. Um, Koreans actually love coffee mix products the most. Um, but when we first jumped onto this product, I was a little doubtful. I was not sure if Atomy could really sell all of this volume. But I thought that I needed to take on the challenge. That is why I was so shocked when I saw new orders being placed as the weeks went by. We started our partnership with Atomy in 2013. In the beginning, Atomy took up about 9% of our revenue, $1.4 million. After that, in 2014, it was $6.1 million, and in 2015 and 2016, that number kept increasing. And in 2017, Atomy's sales were $11.6 million, 35% of our total revenue. 
Atomy's sales had grown about tenfold during this time. The first product we launched was 200 packets of Arabica coffee mix. Then in 2013, we expanded our products into four different kinds. Many consumers had already tried Atomy's black coffee and coffee mix products. So many people were already talking about our product. And many of them already knew that McNulty was the supplier. I believe this was how McNulty was able to go public in Costac as a stock company. Also, personally, it was not easy as a woman to build a company to become a stock company. I believe that our partnership with Atomy was a big help to me in achieving this. We use the CMGT technology when we make Atomy's black coffee. This requires freezing water at negative 196 degrees Celsius and grinding the beans very finely at a nano level. This technology that McNulty has is called cryogenic micro-grinding technology. This is a unique technology that we have. McNulty Coffee's mash is a lot finer than our competitors. The coffee is ground finer than flour. Our technology is taking these very small coffee particles and letting it melt equally throughout the final product. There are only a handful of companies that have this technology in Korea. And it is very difficult to apply this to coffee products. Atomy's coffee mix contains the highest level of coffee. For Atomy's Arabica black coffee, the finely ground coffee powder takes up about 13% of the product. This is much higher than what other companies use. It's also a lot more than how much we use on our own brand's products. For example, in one of our competitors' product, the coffee powder only amounts to 5% of the product. Ours is more than double that because of Atomy's high quality standards. Another important factor is productivity. Recently, we were able to automate our manufacturing lines. We were able to build a new factory dedicated just for Atomy. We were able to add new equipment, and we are currently producing our products with our automated system. It is quite difficult for a medium-sized company such as ours to be able to have a nitrogen filling machine or X-ray detectors in order to improve the product's quality. We have invested a lot in order to improve our product's quality. This is not just due to my own efforts. Rather, it was also because if Atomy's customers had not demanded absolute price and absolute quality, it would have been impossible. The best thing about Atomy was their transaction system. There was a lot of burden on our part because we had to buy our coffee beans in advance. But Atomy has been paying us always on time. So we will surely be able to invest more to our products and give back better products to our consumers. When we were developing and testing our products with Atomy, that's when I thought that this company was something special. I was very inspired by Atomy. Their principle, honesty is the best policy, is something that many small and medium-sized companies can learn from. So, when we work with Atomy, I also think that, in all aspects, we should be fully honest in the process of making our products. That is the only way to have a long partnership with Atomy. When I first started out, I had a vision to be a 100-year company. I want to partner with Atomy for those 100 years. One of the funnier episodes was when I didn't recognize President Park. McNulty's CEO, Eun Jung Lee, asked me a question. I was in the cafeteria and I sat next to President Park. She asked me, Sir, which businesses are you into? I had made a mistake by not recognizing him. So I was flustered. They had sold so many of our products, but I had not remembered his face. So I responded, I'm Atomy's president. And she was very surprised. She exclaimed, oh, that's right, that's right. My face became so red. Uh, it was an episode where both of us laughed very much.
Though it was an embarrassing experience, it showed that I was not trying to smooth talk people. It's okay for our partner's CEOs not to remember my face. As long as the product's quality is good and the price is affordable, Atomy would select our company to sell our products, and they would maintain our partnership. Anatomy also has a policy of one product, one company. This policy is also very helpful for a medium sized company like ours. Uh, in Atomy, we see our partners as part of the family. I was very touched by Atomy's policy of accompanied growth, which maintains a long term relationship with its partners. I am always thankful to the CEOs of our partnering companies who are exerting all of their efforts in order to manufacture the best quality products. Many Korean companies that make coffee mix machines are built so that the amount of coffee, sugar, and creamer can be controlled during the packaging process. Korea is the only country in the world with this packaging technology. I am very excited to see the day when this coffee mix product will take over this world. Atomy will be able to make a world where everyone will be able to enjoy this coffee mix. Atomy's products are not only sold in Korea, but also exported to Taiwan, the US, Japan, and to Southeast Asia. I am confident that coffee mix will grow to be a popular product in these countries as well. Because of the technology that we have, though we have started small, I believe this product will bring us great success in the future. If given the opportunity, my hope is for McNulty to enter into all the countries in the world together with Adam. Thank you very much for always loving our coffee mix. I would like to thank Atomy and all of its members, and especially President Park and CEO Kyung Hee Do, for helping me and McNulty to be able to come this far. I will try my best to manage this company well. Thank you very much.